All right, guys, today we are fishing in a place that has, in the last year or so, became one of my favorite places to fish. It's an extremely tough fishery, but the fish get up there on the bank a lot. They get in the isolated bushes. They get around some of this man-made stuff. You can see there's all this man-made structure behind me. A lot of barges and stuff like that out here with my father-in-law today. Hopefully, we're going to catch us some. Got this chesty on for a change. Been fishing tournament, 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 tournament. Have not wore a chesty very much recently at all, but... We got one on now so let me turn around and show y'all this asian carp that i'm idling over so this is the mississippi river and all of this right here is individual fish all of it they're all carp there's a pretty one all them spots on them usually there's all them spots whenever the fishery is very good this fishery ain't very good but it does have some nice ones in here <laughs> chunky monkey yeah. that's how they mostly are over here he ate that dang thing too. Yeah, he's fat. He's over two pounds and he ain't but 14 and a half inches. Pretty good in there. Another, another little black spot on his tail. So it wasn't filming for that one. Next cast, caught another one. Dude, they eat so good over here. That's what I don't understand. There must just not be a very big population of fish. Look at that on top of his head. Can y'all see that? I ain't never seen one that had that on there. Look how pretty. Hmm. So as I was saying, there must not be a very big population of fish over here. Because when you put it in front of one, they eat it and they are fat. Oh, I missed that one. God, dude, there's like a million right there. Dude, throw one up there. Or did you already? Huh? Did you already throw up there? Spinner bait now. Missed him. Daggum, dude. There. I don't know how many is right there, but there's like a good jillion probably. If I had to throw that jig over there. This last one that's biting is probably a little one. You got him that time. No, he just was running with it. Dude, they are eating this thing up. <laughs> Smashing it. This is actually a Lost River Lures spinnerbait. I've been throwing their spinnerbaits this year. What little I do throw a spinnerbait, that's the one I've been throwing, but just a chunky sucker. And I've got a double willow. It's actually pretty cool. It's got half gold, half nickel blades. Now I just put a three inch swim bait on back just to give them something to really inhale when they bite it. And it's been working for sure. <laughs> he, he hit it like four times unless there's different ones. Striper. I knew there was some of these. That's what's been biting my dang bait all day, I believe. Even he ate it good, man. Look at that. Down that far. Dang, come these suckers are bony. He's bleeding bad. I would have gave that to him. Would have what? I'd have gave that white bass to him. Oh, yeah. There you go. You, you ain't got to set the hook. Just keep reeling. Yeah. There we go. A little buzzer bass. God, they eat it so good. Well, you just give up looking. You got his head up. Look at how they're eating that thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that is like perfect. Hooking them so good. Yeah, that, that hook is not strong. 
Yeah. So you can't like set the hook with braid, but pretty one. Oh, you just turn on and you don't really Yeah, you just keep it. keep reeling it sets itself or like if you you didn't set the hook hard really, but if you do it'll bend it sometimes. Uh oh. There you go. Another one. There must be a little tree or something under the water right there. Yeah, you can look at them Still fleeing. They're biting it though. He got a little mark well, on his back. He swallowed it. Look, I, it's crazy how good. That's why. That's why I'm saying over here is like, I don't think there's a lot of fish. Cause when they bite, dude, they get it, get it. Look at that joker. Pull his eyeball out. That's an all kind of doctored up buzz bait right there. I got it all kind of made where it sounds good. Got a different blade on it. Get him back there. Yep. Messed up his eye. I don't know if we we might have just caught them all. There he is. That looked like a decent one. Nope. Are you good? Are you fighting? Oh, he, I mean, he's not bad. I just thought he might have been like one of two and a half. Oh, yeah. Whenever he bit. They fight you, man. They so fat, man. I mean, just healthy, like. They ain't like super skinny or scrawny. They swallow it. Look how deep they swallow it. Well, look, it's all what you make in the back of his throat. Grab it by the wire, sometimes you'll bend it. God almighty, dude. He's bleeding. Go ahead and chunk him. Yep. Yeah, I got some in the cart. Oh. Oh, did you see that? Stolen from him. Oh, Straight up geez. stolen from him. Oh, biggest, biggest one of the day. Stolen from him. That's a good one, too. Yeah. That is a good one. <laughs> Come on, I should be kidding me. I should be in my room, but... Yeah, he's a good one. <laughs> he, he just swatted a chair. I thought that spinnerbait up here and waked it. Just came up and got it good. That's the kind I like catching. Good ones. That's probably like a 210. Fat sucker. Got them black spots on his mouth. On his tail. Right there. Pretty thick one, man. So the deal today has been overwhelmingly finding the shad. That last little place we caught all them fish, there was just a ton of shad in the area. Lots of fish activity. Really good visibility in the water, which is also rare for here. So I ran to another place that looked very similar. See if we can get to the back and pick us off one of some of this isolated stuff or else find us some more shad and catch us about 10 more of them. So see what we can string together here. All right, back hanging out on the balcony at my in-law's apartment. Y'all seen that's who was fishing with me yesterday on the river that was fishing in, actually the Mississippi River, right outside of Memphis, Tennessee. Pretty cool place to fish. Well, like I said yesterday, one of my favorite fisheries, and we caught some fish. Caught them mostly in one little spot. Really ready to go back over there and fish again. You know, there's a lot of like man-made structure, a lot of riprap, a lot of, a lot of uh, big rock and stuff like that that I want to go there and, and crank a little bit more and stuff like that. So if y'all like that video, leave a like, leave a comment. I might head back over there in the next day or two. So Mississippi River bass fishing, caught them, buzz bait, spinner bait, pretty fun day of fishing for sure. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss anything. Turn the alerts on. We'll see you on the next one. Bank fishing coming up. Bank fishing is coming up right for sure. Now. Everybody been asked about bank fishing? Well, it's coming. I fished from the bank today actually, I think, or yesterday. One of the days I fish on the bank. So whatever, we're coming up soon.